Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Gramps. We are on day 1847 of our trek, and it is time to explore another nugget of wisdom, which includes an inspirational quote, along with some wise words from Gramps for today's trek. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. So we are on our daily trek to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. This is Gramps. Thanks for coming along on today's trek as we increase wisdom and create a living legacy. We are told in Proverbs chapter 16, verse 16, how much better to get wisdom than gold and sound judgment than silver. If you apply the words that you hear today, over time, it will help you to become more healthy, wealthy, and wise as you continue on your daily trek of life. So let's jump right in with today's nugget. And today's quote is an English proverb, and it is... A smooth sea never made a skillful mariner. So today's nugget of wisdom is a skillful mariner. We would like all of our seas of life to be smooth and not buffeted by winds and waves. But that's not how life is. If it were, we would never be able to reach maturity or our full potential in life. Yes, there will be days where life is smooth sailing. But more often than not, many days will be filled with raging waves, torrential rains and powerful headwinds. When we face these conditions as we sail through life, we will become skillful and be able to assist others in facing storms in their lives. The more we experience the storms of life ourselves, the more successful we'll navigate those storms and the more skillful we'll become. The more proficient we become, our capacity to assist others will flourish. So it is with life. We gain the ability to use the wind, rain, and waves to our advantage to drive us forward with greater skill and expertise. Therefore, we should not curse the storms, but adjust our sails to take advantage of those storms. And our passage for today is 2 Thessalonians chapter 1, verses 3-6. through 6. Dear brothers and sisters, we can't help but thank God for you, because your faith is flourishing and your love for one another is growing. We proudly tell God's other churches about your endurance and faithfulness in all persecutions and hardships you are suffering. But God will use this persecution to show His justice and make you worthy of His kingdom for which you are suffering. In His justice, He will pay back those who persecute you. And as you ponder this nugget of wisdom for yourself, please encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past 1,846 treks or read the wisdom journals, they are all available. Wisdom-trek.com And I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day's trek will be downloaded to you automatically. And if you'd also like to receive our weekly newsletter called Wisdom Notes, please email me at guthrie at wisdom-trek.com And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly... I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life, together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you tomorrow for more Daily Wisdom.